Hi everyone and welcome back to Angel. I'm Dave Frost. I hope you're having a great day. Today is season one, episode two. I am so excited for this. It's been a little bit since I watched Angel slash Buffy. Um, and Buffy even longer than that because my finals are coming up. I think I've said it a lot, so I'm gonna stop right about now. Um but I am so excited, especially as like it's like Angel Angel back to back, and it's it's a new series with new people. And with Cordelia is there, and I think this is this show is gonna be really good. Um, <laughs> it's a it's a different tone in Buffy, but I think it's still gonna be really good. I mean, different tone in a way it's less joyful because Angel is that joyful <laughs> at all. Um, but it's still funny and still comedic, and it's still <clears throat> all those really great things that attracted me to Buffy in the first place. Uh, so I am very excited for this. Um, so yeah, I hope you guys are ready. I am ready. I hope you guys are too. And uh, without further ado, let's go with the video. Immediate start where we can't see shit. I do that. I forgot you your name. And join a nightlife. I don't know where that accent is. Is it Scottish? We deserve a night of fun, don't you think? I don't think that's his idea of fun, though. If you want to ask Cordelia out, just do it yourself. Wait a minute, I, d I don't even know if she likes me, man. She probably does not. Good word. Whatever you do, don't let her in on that me being half demon, okay? Be I don't think she cares. She's Cordelia. Right, it's not like you have a signal, folks, and shine in the sky whenever you need help. Right? Batman reference. <laughs> it's uh, right next to a, 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 um, a butterfly? <laughs> it's an angel. Come on, guys, there's a halo. <laughs> Doyle. Ah, I was like, bro, <laughs> she did not hit you that hard and like not enough for an injury or something. Looks like you got your wish. We're going out after all, huh? <laughs> it's so funny because if you mute the audio of this, it's just me in my room, total silence. Uh, I'm going to edit it to show you guys. <laughs> Immediate like. Well, that's not good. We're going to see Cordelia in the intro. Now, uh, Angel 1 is not out on YouTube yet. So I don't know your... Buffy isn't even out. So <laughs> you haven't seen this yet. But my mod did a wonderful job of cutting out Cordelia that I didn't see at all. Someone commented on it on Jangel. You are so right. Uh, he did a wonderful job. There she is. <laughs> I immediately hunched and did that. To, I don't know, or not still believe. Mm, there's like a there's a French song, um, Floyali, that's like that. It's basically it's a song about multiple people and how they regret stuff. And he, the guy, was like watching TV, and his friends were like, "Oh, come hang out with us," and he didn't. And if he had come, he would have met his soulmate and stuff. It was like, ah, oh, bro. It sounded nice, Kevin. Kevin is suspicious. So scared. Hi. If you're in trouble, just call this number. We can help. Dude. Cordelia. This is for like. I, I mean, it's not just for supernatural, but kind of. <laughs> Whatever. It's, it's very cute, but. Look out, Sarah, plain and tall. Has or comes from big money. How do you know all that? Well, you gotta be rich to snag the Calvin Klein model she's leaving with. <laughs> but we need to find someone that's in trouble. How's Angel doing? They were in trouble. Well, she is. Was. Am I okay? He just looked bad. Is this gonna be a theme that everyone he saves is blonde? Like a reference to Buffy or just coincidence? First time. That's really easy. Yeah. <laughs> It's not what he was about to say. Someone. Oh, if I'm keeping you, you know. No, no, no. I I'm just looking for someone to 
rescue? I mean, yes, but... Are you maybe in need of some rescuing? <laughs> For living. I, uh... Well, basically, I'm, uh... I help. I'm a veterinarian. <laughs> I like he was like, I help people to just... <laughs> veterinarian. Messages I get, you know, from the higher powers, whoever they are. So, so I don't know if he thinks they're higher power, if he was told they're a higher power. Well, I was wondering if this is really your number. Mind if I ring you up sometime per date? Yeah, she minds. I can handle this, okay? He's gonna come up and show you who they really are. Well, true, I guess. He's trying to get whatever it is they're looking for. <laughs> Literally, in this case. The more I come to places like this, the harder it gets. Then don't. What about you? What are you? Oh, yeah, no, that's here? sounds right, easy to say. Some place more quiet. Oh. He'd love to, actually, but. Right. Turns out she's a hooker and her pimp here is giving me a hard time. That's it. Okay. I love that he was like at the beginning, like, everyone calm down. I was like, they're kind of pretty calm. <laughs> I mean, it's getting. Right. On the other hand, it's kind of festive. <laughs> I love that everyone's just watching. Every time with you guys. Oh, uh, at least they weren't falsely accused. So, uh, how do you want to do this? Up. Uh, the misunderstandings keep happening. Damn. Right. She looks yeah. really pale. That or is the lighting, but everybody. The socializing thing is brutal. It really I'm is. I guess the single life is particularly tough on you. <laughs> Why? Thank you for well, that, Cordy. A couple hundred years ago, thingy, you can't sleep with anyone, or else you might feel a moment of true happiness and lose your soul, become evil again, and kill everyone. Thanks. Cornelia. Yeah, that was I awesome. You missed the lady in trouble, but I mean, it was pretty big, and she didn't look like she was in any trouble. Oh, was she a virgin? Oh. oh damn i totally expected the opposite what the okay like the way he smile dropped at the beginning what is up with that badly mutilated body found in the dumpster nearly three weeks ago described by the coroner's office as eviscerated has been positively I don't think you should go in there tonight. What do you mean? It might be a killer, you know? What's not? not to go in there. Where are you going? <laughs> it's a... With that knowledge, it's a bit condescending. I can go when you don't... You want and, uh, you can go to hell. Been there. Done that. <laughs> yeah, we haven't really talked about his experience in hell, by the way. Whereas the other girl... Ah! What's up? It's tough. Knowing who you can trust. Not her. It's a good thing high school's over. Oh, was that just a nervous noise or? Yo, man, where's Kevin? Hell if I know. I haven't seen him in here tonight. Why? Wait, what? Dude didn't show up for work today. Probably sleeping it off. What girl? <laughs> you can't just go into conversation, bro. <laughs> Of intestines around its head. I mean, honestly, what kind of statement is this thing trying to make? <laughs> I mean, you know. Nah. What about a last name? Last name? Not in here. Last names in a place like this. Why? Ah, uh, the old phone book. I don't think that exists. In I mean, I don't think that exists anymore. Oh. Well, I guess Kevin was just a sus guy in general. <laughs> Is it coming out of her chest? Oh! So he was weird. It just transfers from person to person. And that's why he was like, hold me. Oh! Oh, that makes so much sense. Okay. Because, like, even if she was evil, he looked really sus at the beginning. He just 
<laughs> ah, there's a vampire look that we know and love. Episode 1 was a bit weird. He's really strong, the demon, that he can put up with Angel. Ow. What are you doing here? <laughs> the mountain of misunderstandings just continue. What this looks like. Uh oh. So do I. My <laughs> tabanush. Part two. <laughs> Where's your license? That's the less part. <laughs> the loneliness might end, and he's gonna keep doing it again. Unless I let you go, so you can stop him. I mean, in this case. Now the police is after you. Ah, my tabarnouche. He's tell just lo. That is so high school. Cordelia wears bras. Ooh, she has girl part. <laughs> Literally. Tad defensive here. You took her bra. How do you feel if she took your boxer? You promise you'll stay good, Cordelia. I'm kidding. Come in. <laughs> I love her so much. What the hell happened to you, man? Okay. Is it my fault that maid service was interrupted? It was supposed to go home, hotel, hotel, husband. Now, can we move on? Hotel husband. Yeah, well, we put weaknesses especially. was amazingly strong while we were fighting. I was right. It may be hard. Gotta keep trying to make the connection. But Katie... Why? Because that's what lonely people do. Uh, it's a demon and it's trying to find the right body. I know you're paraphr- you're quoting yourself on this, but... <laughs> In that case, is she gonna be in on this as well? Or is she gonna die? Oh, well, at least he didn't. She didn't go to the bar this time. Are you just gonna look at every social place around? Oh no, you missed it. Now he doesn't know who it is. This is great. Uh, Talamar? He's been around forever, a dawn of time kind of dude. Again? Any weaknesses? Who are you calling? Kate. Cagney and Lacey Kate? I thought we were hiding from her. We, we are. are. She's been tracking it. Meet me at the bar at seven. Sure, that's actually on my to-do list this week. Walk into a serial killer. Yeah. Look, I can help you, Kate. But you just have to trust me. Oh. <laughs> the line. So is that why she's been coming to the bar? Yeah, you bet. Thanks. Hmm. Have a cup on our side would be great. You don't look like you're in your element here. Can it shapeshift? This number. Tell the sergeant that I need. Some <gasps> so it is. It can shapeshift. I am so confused. Oh, so. Oh no, maybe there was just like the girl did this guy and then we just skipped the night. That I. But is he gonna try to bond with Angel? Or maybe it can't because he's a vampire. I would love for her to see it so it'd be like, yes, there's demons. Oh, sh it's. Oh yeah, it's decomposing. Oh man, all these people. Hey, excuse me. That's really a beautiful dress you're wearing. I mean it. Yeah, I mean, you have blood all over your shirt. You. Angel. Man, he's looking real bad. At this point, just hug someone from behind. I mean, I don't want that to happen, but. I just want to hold you. <laughs> Why does it have to be a girl? Like the op or you know, the opposite sex. Yeah, I feel like that's a if the thing has to find a new body every time. Like this challenge. <laughs> It's gonna be less strong now because it's really weak. Or not! <laughs> That's. Ah, uh, fire. Put it in the fire. Ooh, Eldritch Towns. Please, is she gonna see the demon? The bartender was connected to everyone. It's not him. Yes. Illegally, no warrant. Why are you telling me? I don't know. 
trusting people. Some pretty weird stuff for a veterinarian. <laughs> what is this, a lobster? It's an angel. Just changed to the Zygarde. Like no, young at all. That the three of us. Go up. Or we can go home. And you could sit in the dark alone. <laughs> God, yes. Thank you. <laughs> oh, he was just so unhappy about it. Like, he's just not the social person like Buffy is. So, this was really fun. Um, I like the investigating thing. And, like, Buff yes, Buffy does that, but she has, like, soul. And she kind of. This is literally, like, an investigation, and I really like that. Um,. I really like it. Um, the, the what I wanted to say was basically the demon, like, oh, it's been until like the end of time since you've been here, and I'm like, in all this time, like at the beginning of time, my bad, until the beginning, from the beginning of time that you were here, and you still didn't find a right body, like. You fucking loser! <laughs> At this point, like, there's must have been like thousands of humans or something, and you just get what the fuck? I mean, unless it's like his species has been around since the beginning of time, which is very different. But like, bro, that's that's kind of sucky. That's kind of sucky. Put in my ear, I managed. <laughs> um but yeah it was really fun we get to see that how this is gonna go basically how this is gonna go how this series is gonna turn out and how like um yeah how it's gonna turn out and how the team is getting along i like Cord I'm, I'm so happy Cordelia is here. There's like two people of the same kind of place, which I really like. Um, so, we can go on the leg. Oh, my leg is in pain. Um, but yeah, I thought it was really fun and I really liked um, just kind of Angel being in stuff, like being socially awkward. Like, it's. It's not the same vibe as Buffy by being Angel. You get what I mean? Like, the, like, socially awkward vibes and stuff, and just... And it's just kind of annoying, too, and it's just fun to see. Um, and in making other human connections, because uh, before, ever since he gained his humanity back, he's not had many people. <laughs> he's not had many people to talk to. Or stuff like that. Um, and humans, mostly. So this is forcing him to talk to people. And I think it's really... It's great for him to just kind of talk. I mean, of course, he... Like, while still doing his own stuff. And I think that's really great. And I like Cordelia being there. And just being kind of like a secretary. I don't know if by the end of this he'll have a whole ass... Like, investigation ward or something. But that would be really fun. Um, it would be really cool if that happened. Um, and yeah, and I, the guy that I can never remember the name, um, Glenn, Glenn Quinn, um, I think, nice, uh, his, his powers I'm a bit confused about, <laughs> in the way that, like, they're really fucking vague. And I don't remember, like, I haven't edited the first episode yet. So usually I, I just have remember stuff. But he was like, in this episode, oh, it comes from a higher power and stuff. Yeah, because, you know, from the higher power. Who there, you know, it's my gift. Um, the higher powers. But does he know it's a higher power? Does he think it's a higher power? Because they're two very different things. <clears throat> you know, um, so, 
yeah, it's it's very strange. It's I don't know what to. Also, we don't know what demon he is, what type of demon he is. So I think that would help. Also, does his species normally have um, visions and like what is what does his species of vampires do and uh, of vampires of demons do? Um, so I think that would be nice to see and point out. And if uh, Kate, so yeah, Kate can stay. I think that would be really nice because. Um, well, it would be nice if she said like to have like a contact with police. I think she's gonna stay, um, because well, you know, she still knows him and she knows how to reach him and stuff. So just right now, we just have to wait for her to be brought back into the supernatural, which I think won't take that much time, uh, with all the stuff happening in the city. Um, but yeah, I've also like this different kind of vibe because Buffy. Uh, yes, it was like different demons and stuff, but it was happening, all happening with the high school. It was all hap- ow, ow, ow. Okay, sorry, I had to crack my shoulder. It was all happening with the, the school or like the bronze. Well, this is like before it was, um, it was like a bar, it was like, you know, stuff like different stuff like that. Um, or like a, bar, a party and stuff. So I think- that's great the kind of variety that we can we're getting um so i like that <laughs> i like that i'm gonna watch buffy like tomorrow or friday uh so i'm happy to, this is gonna be a nice balance that i really like and i can't wait to see the like the team ups and everything um so yeah i'm looking forward to it i'm really looking forward to it um there's also like still the um the organization from last time that was like oh we must protect our clientele and stuff um so we that we haven't seen them today um today how did they say that we haven't seen them today but we're gonna probably see them soon um and like who they are and like what's happening and stuff so i think that's really great and I'm looking forward to it. So without further ado, let's look at the extras. So today, Lonely Heart, 7.5 out of 10. 85, yeah, that's really low. Death count. Uh, Kevin was killed by Talamore. Sharon Rechler, killed by Talamore. Neil, killed by Man, he killed, like, by himself. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Five people. Damn. Him alone. <laughs> um, so yeah, six, six. He did all the. He did five humans in this round, so that's pretty intense. Uh, nine to five women killed by Talonwar. Danny killed and possessed by Talonwar. Talonwar is fired by. Uh, David Fury wrote this episode to replace his original script title, Corrupt, which also introduced a new character of Kate. However, in Fury's first script, Kate had a crack cocaine addiction and worked undercover as a prostitute. Producer Tim Meaner says the episode was a little bit too hopeless and a little too grim. Okay. Special effects supervisor Loni Paris there explained that to get the effect of the demon burrowing through the characters' bodies, Dave Miller built a prosthetic back to identically match the actor. Oh wow. We shot the actor doing his acting with tracking points little marks on his back and had to stuff edge batted and tracked in a locked off version of the actor's back with the burrowing demon is stuck in on there. That's a lot of dedication because like we saw that for like the second, second and a half. So I was like, it's pretty good. Uh, David Boreana's stunt double, Mike Massa, says the scene in which he's tossed across the room upside down is his favorite stunt of the season. To get the effect, he was shot across the room using an air ram. He said the reason I like it so much is because it really knocked the <laughs> It was 900 pounds of thrust in on, the, on the air ram. I had to get this, the corner just right. If I was off, if I had a dead center of the corner with my shoulders spread, it could have broken a collarbone. I had to hit it sideways, my back flat to the wall and kind of skipped into it, but just pile drove me right to the ground. There, James A. Connor was jumping up and down. He thought it was the best stunt he'd ever seen. Damn. Like, the risk of, like, a collarbone? 
Angel pulls out a grappling hook gun and fires it over a wood beam, causing Kate to ask, Who are you? This is a direct reference to a scene in the 1988 Batman film. Oh, it wasn't like an early Batman reference, but I didn't catch that one. Angel teams up. Lonely Hearts Club, Lonely Hearts. All the episode is named Lonely Heart, and it mainly confused was mistakenly called Lonely Heart. And this is French. <laughs> Guys, I mean, can't seem to say fit. Angel teams up. That sounds such like, guys, Power Girl team up. Like, <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> this is all. It's really easy to just be like, okay, it's Cœur de Solitude, un Cœur de Solitude, la Solitude dans le cœur. That works as well. <laughs> what the heck? What the heck, French? Um, so that was it. I hope you guys liked the video. I certainly liked it. I'm having a lot of fun. I hope you guys are too. If you did like it, don't be afraid to leave a like. Don't forget to subscribe below. Make a comment. All the stuff. I said the order got screwed in my head. Uh, you can check out my Patreon uh, for a full and I got reaction. And let's forget this outro. And uh, ciao. <laughs>